from AliExpress. 4.6 US dollars with 40% off, it was 7.7 dollars, .7, you can get this gadget. And what is it? The model is KWS DC28, 0.96 inch DC voltage ammeter, TFT HD digital display power meter cell phone charging tester detector electrician tool. Alright, I ordered it and I got it. Bubbles. Alright. A zip bag model. KWS DC28. That is correct. One, two, and we have the, the third package. Nicely wrapped. All right. And what it says in description? Electric current 0 to 12 amperes, voltage 4 to 30 volts, voltage plus current detection, recording power on data. All in one display compatible with all kind, kinds of DC port devices. Okay, and product parameters voltage in DC from 4 to 30 volts. It says it can measure current from 0 to 12 amperes, that is power 360 watts capacity measurement from 0 to 6666 milliampers energy from 0 to 9999 watt hours timing 0 to 99 hours size 60 by 20 by 12 millimeters all right let's test it first removing this protector right here come on nice so from one side we have DC jack 5.5 by 2.5 millimeter DC jack male and from this side we have female DC jack it says positive negative inside that pin is positive on this male jack we have in and out sign and only one tuck switch. Okay, plug in 12 volts in 3, 2, 1. Whoa! Color screen. It shows the input voltage right now is 11.4 volts, amperes 0, watts 0. The time, the milliampers, the milliwatts. And the CPU, CPU, 20 degrees. It measures the CPU inside. When you push the button, we have maximum watts, maximum amperes, and maximum volts right here. Reading that is nice. And what is this? Back again. All right. And when you double push the switch, look what happens. It rotates the, the screen like this. One more time. Yes, back. So this one can be input and output. And also the, this one. Let's try it. It's my portable power supply that gives 12 volts. Right now it's 11.3. And I'm gonna try it. And yes. The both DC jack jacks can be input or output. How nice is that? Okay, now let's hook up a bulb or something, some big load to test it. The amperes it says that is 360 watts, 12 amperes. But first, quickly. Let's compare, compare the voltage that is on the display 11.45 with my multimeter and what it says 
48. It's okay. Okay. Maximum voltage 11.4. My power supply is set on 6.7 volts. That will be input for the power meter. Plug in the light bulb lights and at 6. Point, what is that? 7 volts is pulling 3.68 amperes. Beautiful. I'm going to increase the voltage to 12 maybe. Also, why it's not working? 9.9 .9 volts, all right. Little bit more. 12 volts and, and at 12 volts the bulb is pulling 5.1 ampere also shown on the power supply we have 12 volts and with pressing the button you can see the time the milliampers the milliwatts hours and right here you can see 64 watts the load is pulling 64 watts maybe it's too bright working great let's try something d different Six point six volts all links will be in description below for this gadget you can check out and what is beautiful about this power meter you can use it for your laptop using the power adapter that give 19 volts and look we have a readout of 19.8 volts and this gadget you can use it as testing equipment for seeing does the laptop is charging correctly or finding a problem right I'm gonna correct it and we're gonna see it's pulling 1.1 ampere charging the laptop because probably is full let's turn it on yes the the amperes are increasing 2 amperes 2.2 amperes the laptop is charging and working fine 44 watts this is awesome gadget 3.1 ampere all right and it's down to one point no 2.1 ampere 2.6 this is beautiful gadget you can see the watts the milliampers hours the time the voltage when you press you're gonna see the maximum watts it was 67 watts maximum amperes 3.4 and maximum voltage 19.8 volts beautiful so both jacks DC jacks can can be input or output with beautiful TFT screen color screen this gadget is awesome for the money I like it I hope you like it so please give a like share and subscribe to my channel see ya that was all for today